Welcome to PC Wits Kits Tech Talk. Well, Firefox 3.5 is out, the final version, and I thought I'd download it and benchmark it against 3.0, which I have installed here on Windows XP. So um, I have a regular laptop here that I'm running this test on. I've got 3.0.11 installed. It's an Intel dual core that I'm running. And um, I'm going to run the FutureMark Peacekeeper test first to see how many points we get and it's obviously 512 points that are broken down into different categories of tests of course and uh, you can see it right here now of course if you have a different uh, PC if it's Windows Vista Windows 7 if it's faster hardware obviously you're gonna get different points but at the end of the day we're comparing browsers not PCs or OS's now I upgraded to the version 3.5 of Firefox and you can see here that on the same machine same OS, double almost, 900 points. So obviously there's been some significant improvements from 3.0 to 3.5. And uh, you can see it right here. Now just to confirm all that, I run the Sun Spider JavaScript benchmark that gives a little bit more variety of real world balanced tests, right? So we wanted to do that. And it also confirmed that there's about a two to two and a half here uh, increase in performance so obviously there's a difference a much much faster difference in all of the tests that it performed with relating to the JavaScript engine for example okay now of course when you do add-ons that's always that's always a question right what type of add-ons do I get are the add-ons going to be compatible later on with future browser versions well in a lot of cases they're not right and that's why Firefox gives you a note right there when you go to upgrade that uh, there, the chances are your themes are not going to work, right, to go and get newer ones. But when it comes to the extensions and the add-ons, I did update those in 3.5 and um, those worked fine. Okay, so my extensions, those add-ons like these, the download helper, the no script, uh, the ad blocker, those ones worked fine, but my themes did not. So I'll just have to go out and get some more themes from the, um, from the website. No big deal. Other improvements, though, other than the engine for faster rendering, which is contributing to it being much faster, it's got open video natively supported in it. The private browsing is now official in there. You've got the clear history that's been enhanced, location aware browsing, and some persona skins. Basically, uh, skins in a box, you know, you just select and uh, it applies everything for you. Uh, if you want to download it, mozilla.com, of course. And I'm going to try out all these new features and I'll make a second video about all of those, okay? So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.